Sana in charge of presentation. We Elias Club prepared a presentation on the topic of inevitable non-contact future minded students. I'd appreciate it if you listen to it until the end. Uh, I will present in the order of introduction, materials and methods, research and conclusions. From 2020, a new epidemic called COVID-19 has appeared and started to infect all over the world. And now in Korea, the number of confirmed cases in Korea has also increased, and now the number easily exceeds 1,000 a day. If you take a look at the screen, you can tell that the numbers of tests and the cases of COVID-19 in Korea has been increased compared, compared to that of last year's. Also, you can see a sudden increase of the cumulative number of confirmed cases worldwide. Accordingly, most schools and academies conduct classes through online lectures. Therefore, the influences of online classes is also increasing. As a research method, we went through the stages of planning, research, and analysis. First, the professors advise students' opinions and literature research related to online education were conducted. Through several online meetings with our team members, the research research are completed and the statistics were analyzed by frequency. Dongnam University also provides non-face-to-face -face education through LMS, which is a system that allows you to listen to lecture online, solve quizzes, check attendance, and submit assignments. Our club surveyed clinical pathology students on lectures through LMS by neighbor survey form. About 40% of the respondents were males, and 60% of them were females. And uh, Percentages of 1st, 2nd, and 3rd graders were 15 to 43 and 5% respectively. About half of them answered that it was normal in terms of overall satisfaction with the non-face-to-face -face lecture system, and 42% said that they were satisfied. 10% of the students said they were dissatisfied. And when asked about the advantages of non-face-to-face -face lectures, most of the respondents said that they can watch repeatedly and that they can take classes regardless of location. On the other hand, regarding the disadvantages of non-face-to-face -face lectures, there were opinions such as there are limitations in conducting practical courses non-face-to-face, -face, difficulty in concentrating, difficulty in immediate feedback, and inconvenient attendance. The satisfaction survey on the quality of online lectures by professors about half answered that it was normal, with 33% of satisfaction and 16% dissatisfaction. When asked whether communications with professors through non-face-to-face -face lectures is smooth, the second most common opinion was that it was not smooth. And when asked how they want to be educated non-face-to-face -face except LMS system, they answered that they want real-time lectures or conducting face-to-face -face lectures only for practical classes or providing practice videos. These are the opinions of our club members on the research of non-face-to-face -face classes and surveys. To tell you a few things, uh, there were opinions that they were worried about the degradation in practical skills and it, it was efficient because the time spent outside of the lecture was reduced. And regarding the survey, there was an opinion that the quality of lectures seemed to have improved a lot compared to the early days of non-face-to-face -face lectures as the overall satisfaction of students was high. So we thought about how to supplement this education method, and then referred to how to online classes are being conducted elsewhere. Hanyang University also introduced a life-size professor holography class. At Asa Medical Center in Seoul, nurses can experience nursing skills in virtual reality by wearing VR devices. And Arundel Country Schools in the United States, States uses robots, which have iPads, so you can show the inside of the classroom to students at a distance with screens and cameras. Also, COVID-19 has caused many changes in the medical system. For example, a lens that can diagnose diabetes with tears has, been, has recently been invented. This lens diagnoses diabetes by analyzing glucose in tears. 
Immediately after the diagnosis, the research are delivered to the mobile phone, so the research can be checked quickly. In the past, diabetes was measured by a blood glucose meter. This measuring instrument put a psychological burden on patients and there was also a risk of infection through the needles. But this lens is good, for, good news for diabetic patients because there's no more risk if they use this contact lens. And a robot for the diagnosis of the coronavirus was also invented, which consists of a master device operated by a medical staff and a slave device facing the examiner. The master device has a camera attached to it so it can be controlled remotely and enabling safer tests. The robot can prevent the spread of the dangerous viruses such as COVID-19 by non-face-to-face -face testing. As mentioned earlier, the quality and convenience of medical services are expected to increase as the non-face-to-face -face medical system gradually develops. However, there are some precautions. Uh, first of all, QCD is expensive, but no health insurance is applied to it. So, the patient's cost burden is high. Also, since the PUCD device can be used by people who are not doctors, we need to think about whether the research are reliable. So the importance of quality control is getting bigger. We were able to hear the opinions of several students through the survey. We think LIS Club highly appreciated that the effect of we can study in an easier and more convenient environment than contact lecture through the research of these student surveys. We are also able to feel that this method has a good advantage over contact lectures. However, as non-contact lectures progress, there are many words that they cannot experience that the practice environment. Uh, and as a solution to this, I thought it would be necessary to develop a virtual world education method through VR and scientific development in the future. In preparation for such non-contact development, students and clinical pathologists should keep in mind that they are in an important position. Students are required to study self-development based on clinical pathology taught in school. In addition, clinical pathologists should greet patients with responsibility in the medical field. We had several online meetings for this study, and as you can see on the screen, we reviewed for many previous studies. Hello, my name is Tae Hyun Park. I'm a student at Dongnam University. Our team conducted research related to online lectures on the topic of Inside Corona and Inside Korea. Hello, we are a PPT team. My name is Myung-Nim Lee. Uh, I was in charge of our contact education among the methods part. Hello, my name is Golden Am. Um, was in charge of our text medical among the methods parts. Hello, my name is Dong Jun Kim. At this conference, I made introductions and conclusions. Hello, Bye. everyone. Hello, everyone. My name is Yun Zhu Li. My name is Song Ju Park. We were in charge of making posters for this conference. Actually, we are freshmen in college, but we are participating together to help our seniors. Hello, my name is Ajin Che. I'm a sophomore at Dongnam Health University. I was in charge of data research and helped to write abstract. Thank you for listening to our presentation. Hello, I'm Moon Soyeon, a sophomore Dongnam Health University. I am 24 years old and a member of the LIS Academic Club. I've been preparing a lot for the conference. Let me ask for your attention. Thank you. Hello, everyone. My name is Soyeon Bak, a student at Dongnam Health University. I'm a member of a clinical chemistry club called LIS. In this club, I was in charge of data searcher. This topic was very interesting, so researching the data was fun. Thank you for listening. Thank you for listening to the presentation. 
uh, and I'll be happy to answer your questions. If you have any questions, I'll be pleased to answer them. Thank you. And you'll want to tread it every day. That path is Dongnam Health University.